He Shoyam Jin is a Chinese billionaire businessman and entrepreneur who is the co-founder of Media Group, one of the world's largest appliance makers. He is also one of the richest people in China and the world, with a net worth of $28.8 billion as of September 2021, according to the Bloomberg Billionaires Index. He was born on October 5, 1942, in Shanda, Guangdong Province, China. He started his business with 23 villagers making glass bottles and plastic lids in 1968. At age 38, he switched to electric fans and named his company Midea. He later expanded his product range to include air conditioners, refrigerators, washing machines, and other appliances. He grew his business into a multinational conglomerate with more than 200 subsidiaries, including Germany-based robotics firm KUKA and Indonesia-based electronics firm Polytron. He also invested in various sectors, such as banking, real estate, logistics, and healthcare. He stepped down from Midea Group operations in 2012 and handed over the management to his longtime deputy Fang Hangbo. He remains the largest shareholder of Midea Group with a 35% stake. His son He Jianfeng is a director of Midea Group and Midea Real Estate Holding. He is married and has three children. He lives in Foshan in Jannin International Golf Life Village, a villa neighborhood developed by Midea Real Estate Group. He is also a noted art collector and founded the He Art Museum, a privately funded non-profit museum designed by Pritzker Prize winner Tudao Hando. He survived an attempted kidnapping in June 2020, when assailants broke into his villa and held him hostage. His son escaped and alerted the police, who rescued him and arrested five suspects. The key lesson that he showed and learned from his life and business career is the importance of innovation and diversification. He believes that one should always try new things and explore new markets to stay ahead of the competition and adapt to the changing customer needs. He also believes that one should diversify one's product range and business interests to reduce risks and increase opportunities to help. Some of the challenges and failures that he faced include Starting his business with limited resources and facing financial difficulties in his early years. He had to borrow money from relatives and friends to buy equipment and materials. He also had to overcome technical problems and quality issues in his production process. Facing competition and regulation in the appliance industry, which is the main source of his fortune. He had to innovate and diversify his products and services to maintain his market share and profitability. He also had to deal with the environmental and social impacts of his business, such as energy consumption, waste management, and labor relations. Surviving an attempted kidnapping in June 2020, when assailants broke into his villa and held him hostage. His son escaped and alerted the police, who rescued him and arrested five suspects.